The hit is a hit and and you just think, well, this was great. I must have done everything perfectly and goodbye. That's the end of that. A flop, you just you just spend months if you're not careful. If you don't, this is why I love Ambien so much. But um, <laughs> but um, <laughs> but you you spend months thinking. I should have done this, and what if I had done that, and why didn't I, why did I cast that person, and why did I use that thing, and I never should have said that, and, and, and it's true by the way of life, too. I mean, you do it with the, with the friendships that fail and the romantic things that fail. They take up way more space in your head than the happy little stories that, that are successful. What have, what have you learned? I mean, we, we had at our conference at the weekend in New Orleans, we had a great uh, interview with Barry Diller, and it was called My Favorite Mistake. Uh, and um, I wondered if there was, and the theme really was just about how failure is such a growing process for yes, everybody. Yes, but I don't but, believe that. But you don't believe that. <laughs> <laughs> but, no, but that's what do you what learn? People, you don't see, think you learn from that? You know, the thing I really do believe, and I say this in the book, is that the main thing you learn from failure is that it is entirely possible you will have another. <laughs> well, that's, isn't that a useful thing? Well, it's, it's useful, but it's not what you're talking about, which is, I mean, maybe that's a growth experience, <laughs> but, uh, but I don't so think that's what people mean who write those books that, that are so full of peppy things about what I learned from failing and I learned <laughs> I would never again, um, you know, buy high and sell low, whatever <laughs> it is. 